Hello YouTube and welcome to Autodesk Maya 2017 training series. So today what we're going to do is we're going to uh, limit information and sometimes when you actually animate you don't want the particular object to move a certain position, especially the controller. So I'm going to create a curve here as well. So usually when you move the object it's actually infinite and you, you can actually move other objects as well. So let's say if I just want to move the object uh, sideways, what I can do is, let's say my, just my translate X is moving right now, I can select all of these later, uh, let's select all of these, shift select all of these and right click and I can actually lock these. So once I lock these, you can see that only that part moves and here I cannot move it. I can also limit the information. So if I were to go into uh, my attribute editor, I can see something called limit information in my pcube section. So over here, there's something called limit information. So I can set the maximum and minimum value I have. So I'm on my translate. So I'm going to go into translate. So go over here. You can see that my current position is this. So I want this to be from nine to minus 14. Okay, minus 14 is the smaller value. So I'm going to select, just select this so I can, it goes to the uh, minimum value limit x, go to the maximum, set max value. So now what actually happens is it limits the information. Usually it's true for controllers because controller you have to move it to a certain position only. So I'm going to do that. So go to the nerve object right here. I'm going to limit the information. Let's say I want to move this sideways only. So I just want to keep sideways z. So deselect this by pressing control, right click and key select it not key selected, sorry, it's lock selected. Okay, so locked. And I want to limit the information right here so I cannot move this up and down. So I want to limit the information. So this is the max and min. So let's say nine to minus 15 is the information I want. So let's go to attribute editor, nerve circle and over into the translate, I'm gonna say nine to 15. So over here, I'm gonna say uh, minimum value is going to be minus 15 and positive value is going to be 9 right here. Uh, I actually accidentally set it 0, so I'm going to set it 9 again, so I can manually enter it as you can see. So once I do that, you can see that the um, information is limited right there. So that is how you limit information, and if you were to uncheck this, then you can again move it infinite, but if you were to press 9, then you limit the information. So in this way, you don't risk uh, animating the parts that you don't want, and you also have more control over the animation. So hope you guys learned something as always and as always please like comment share and subscribe